hope your dad is calling you. Hi there, welcome to my channel. It's me, Teresa. And in this week's episode on Fansite Friday, I'm going to be taking you behind the scenes of the photo shoot that Paige and I kind of curated. I'll make sure to link her OnlyFans or her Twitter or whatever down below in the description bar so you can check her out. And Amanda's information will also be down there as well. The weekend of Halloween, fortunately Paige knew of this girl. Her name is Amanda. She was fabulous and she was super easy to work with we got everything figured out in less than a week you know we had originally intended to do some content with a couple other girls and last minute we didn't feel as if we were provided the information necessary to go into this photo shoot feeling confident so that we would do our best work we got a suite at a hotel so that it had different locations that we could shoot at you know we did some on the couch we did some on the bed we did some in the bathroom and we did some like in the little kitchenette area we chose some really easy costumes you know one was black silk robes and then the other we did was like baking kind of we wore aprons and just like thongs it was really cute collab content is a great way to make more money on OnlyFans. And one thing that was really cool about getting to meet Amanda is that she actually uses Fansly more than OnlyFans. So if you check out my video ranking the different fan site websites, I kind of go into the fact that I'm not very familiar with Fansly. So she talks about why she likes the tier system that Fansly uses over OnlyFans and how OnlyFans affected her income once they released that whole scandal that I also talked about a couple months ago in a follow-up video about the different fan site platforms. So if you're looking for more ways to make money on OnlyFans and you kind of want to figure out how to plan some collab content with multiple girls, just keep in mind that the more people there are, the more organization there needs to be so that everybody feels comfortable going into the situation. And you're gonna get to hear some of the things that we talk about behind the scenes. So if you're excited for that, make sure you stick around till the end of the video. Welcome to the one day Playboy Mansion. I'm Teresa. Hello. Hello. Oh, Hi. Yeah, we're vlogging right now, actually. Oh, we are? Yeah. Yeah, I did. We were talking shit before. Now we're vlogging. You're probably out of frame because I like my yeah. hair right there. No, you can only see me. I can see me from like here. Oh, okay. Before we were gossiping, so we were not vlogging. <laughs> I got a little bit of the gossiping on it, but I'm going to edit it's that not out. It's live, though. Yeah, okay. No, no it's not. No. <laughs> I was like, we're on live camera? Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, I'm really yeah. awkward on camera. When you invited me to this, I was like, I, I'll do it, but... Uh. I was surprised that you didn't already have, like, have plans for Halloween. She was like, we should find another girl. And I was like, this late? Yeah, this was 30 minutes for me. Just the, I guess, with Halloween, the area that I live in is really close to, like, all, like, you know, my goals and Target and stuff like that. So I had to go through 15 minutes of traffic just right there because it's so crowded. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you have people that actually exactly. like <laughs> every time. are nice exactly. to you. I have like the meanest people ever, I swear. I feel like it kind of varies for me. Yeah. Yes. For sure. Mm -hmm. Especially now that I have fans leaves and it's like, now I know which tier you're in. Oh. I was gonna ask you about that. How do you like Fansly? I actually like it a little bit better than OnlyFans. So I'm making more money. Oh, really? Yeah. That's kind of what I was telling Paige about. I was like, I wonder if, like, after all of the things with um, OnlyFans, if oh, that's like why income. they fucked my income. I pushed them to move. So all of my clothes, basically, especially because I do bundles mm -hmm. uh, every Friday, I tell them on Friday, like. Oh, by the way, if you had a premium subscription, this would be five dollars because it's half off. Mm -hmm. If you had VIP, this would be free, and that's where I'm making my most money because my yeah. VIP is twenty five dollars, and it uh, guarantees like no, you, there's no pay per view, there's no like you don't have to pay for bundles, so you get all the bundles free, um, and one free custom a month. And so I have far more VIP subscribers than I do any other here. Yeah, and that's what I've made most of my money off of is subscriptions versus on OnlyFans it was tips. Yeah. Where I'd make my like 
money. Yeah, that's where I'd get mine in like a um, pay-per-view, but I've noticed that too. Like everybody just like freaked out when everything happened with OnlyFans yeah. and like just jumped yeah, ship. Then they're asking me like, oh, am I, am I gonna be able to like keep this if like OnlyFans shut down it's porn or if you shut down your site? I'm like, I don't know. Right, like this isn't, I'm not OnlyFans. I can't tell you that. Oh, I'll support, I guess. So that's why I was like, buy my Dropbox. I guess submit my idea just to be done with it. Cause that hadn't even occurred to me. Honestly. With OnlyFans, I've never had like collapse. I don't know how that works either. You can just drop the app. Yeah. Oh, like, so I'm, I'm gonna have to have to change this out because now everybody's gonna like know who that is. Because I started talking about collabing with him. We're not gonna like have sex or anything. I'm definitely not like trying to be the next Kim K with the sex tape out there um, when I'm still in college and trying to get a job. <laughs> no. No. And I can kind of like, if I need to take any out for my vlog, then I can just do that. I really don't want to. I don't know how much I need. I've never thrown flour. <laughs> have, you ever, have you ever thrown flour? I've never. I don't no. know what to expect. Just like a handful to start just off Just make sure your hand's not wet when you throw Oh, 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 oh my god. <laughs> Feels weird. Right Look at it getting like caught underneath my nails. Okay, I'm a little nervous because we might have to hose off after this. But like, okay, everybody aim down. Below the neck. Yeah. yeah. Put your hair behind here so that it doesn't like get in your hair. Thanks. And you put aim like, like aim kind of. I mean, like you throw it on my ass yeah, or my back. like a flower hand on her back. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Spicy. <laughs> I'm sprinkling down you. Yes. Mm. Beautiful. Yes. I'm trying to get it in your hair. Oh, you're good. You're here. Oh, well. Yeah. It's just flour. Should I? If you have a hair dryer, it'll come right out. That's <laughs> true. We should. Point. We should. I know. Should we take just like some stills like this? You can post them out of the video too, right? Right. I was kind of thinking that we could sell that though. Just like cheap, you know, or like post it as like a video. What if we? I'm breathing it in. Okay, I know I said I didn't want to get flour and everything, but I think it'd be kind of cool. Or a handful. Like, kind of like on the groundish. Does that make sense? Like if I like tilt the camera, kind of like looking down, and we're like on our knees, and kind of throwing it. Maybe that would be like a better pay per view. Like on our like we're on our knees, and you're throwing it on. Like we're all kind of on the ground. Would yeah. Would be better yeah. off doing that with whipped cream? Would it be a little? I mean, we could do bowls. Is it gonna be obvious that we're on a sheet or do we not care? I don't think we care because I think they'll understand so why. Or, like we have to clean up. Well, men are stupid. They probably won't even notice. All right. They'll be like, oh, oh hot women together in same room. Oh, women in the kitchen. With clothes on. Well, should we kind of like start with clothes on and kind of like strip as we go? You don't care if these are covered in a bunch of shit. Okay. That's kind of like what I had envisioned. Okay. Good job. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was a little aggressive. Oh, no. Oh, no. no. Ooh, you like that? <laughs> <laughs> Blog it flooding in the sink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's the content that people want to see. Ooh. Behind the scenes, both frosting, not freaking going. I don't know. Wait. <laughs> what is the way nothing is happening for me? Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Why would they leave that in the sink? When you're all hot, but not smart. Just blonde things. <laughs> like, oh, oh my god! <laughs> that was aggressive. Okay, well. At least it worked that time. Uh, at better. least we didn't break it. Hey, I right? was scared we like, good news. Mess up the hotel sink. That's better. Okay. okay. Oh, I thought I getting abused. Literally. I'm just assuming my face is fine. Huh? 
Um, your dad is calling you. My dad? Teresa's dad. Yeah, I was like, mm. and I looked over, I didn't realize she was still filming. So I looked over and it was just me naked and it said, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I feel whenever he calls me when, like, in the middle of filming content. I always just ignore him because, like, I'm sorry, but, like, okay. it takes me out of the zone. Uh, somebody's calling me, actually. Who is it? Daddy. Of course. I don't know. I love my name, Small Dick. What's up? Hey, you know this is Bobby, right? It says Bobby on caller ID, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. I was like, I don't know. It just started doing that shit. I didn't know if you saved my number or not. But, I should hey, probably delete doing, it. Right? I'm um, in lingerie eating whipped cream off two hot bitches. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Bobby. Oh, oh for <laughs> all of this is on video. Oh, it is on video, by the way. <laughs> Going in the vlog. Behind the scenes. Oh, that's kind of cool. Bye. Want somebody to be like, hey, this you is how like you're mean mugging your camera. <laughs> like, I'm not trying to be mean. It's too much. It's not like they're bad. It's just like, you know, you're just kind of making the same face at home. It's the face I'm making in that one, like when we're all kind of laughing. I'm like, <laughs> Okay, let's do one more serious one, and then we'll do something like laughing. I think part of it is kind of like if you're leaning back to the couch a little bit too much. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm hungry. I'm getting hungry. Okay, I think that that's good. Because what I was going to do is I was going to upload it all to my computer and then we can go all through all of it but like if you're heading home then like that might that'll take too long so you can just send stuff to me in the water yeah i'm just afraid that it'll be like too much you know i might maybe i should like make a dropbox or something um you can actually uh, on iphone you can add people to your album and share it uh, sick okay yeah no i've seen that like shared album mm -hmm. feature That's i just what have I did never with used it before me and maya have a shared album yeah like Definitely. I'll definitely do that. Like I said, this shoot was so much fun. I loved getting to meet Amanda. She was so precious. I loved her. Um, and we had a great time shooting everything. I think that we have definitely been able to communicate and get all of that content out. So if you'd like me to do like a follow-up video on how to plan out some collab content, I think that that would also be really a lot of help for people who are trying to make more money on OnlyFans because I think collab content is a great way to go, especially if you're in an area where you either know other girls that are on OnlyFans or you can meet verified creators. I love getting to meet Amanda. She was super nice. I love getting to connect with other creators and also hearing about her experience on a different fan site, just getting a different perspective. I'm so happy that I was able to share that with you. I think, like I said in the last video, that my main goal with this channel is to kind of let people see behind the scenes in the life of a content creator, just so that you can understand that we're still people too. So it's really cool to get to see a couple of us all interact, especially when we have to work as a team to actually like make something happen. I think a lot of people overlook how much planning and effort goes into 
creating the content that we do. So I really enjoyed being able to meet another creator and create new content together and collaborate with her. And obviously everyone knows I love working with Paige. She's my best friend. Like I said, if you want me to make another video that's going over like how to plan a collab photo shoot, make sure you like this video, leave a comment down below and subscribe so that you are notified once I do put that video out and I will see you in the next one.